How does nicotine affect the teenage brain different to any other age group? Different parts of your brain mature at different ages and the final part to mature is your prefrontal cortex at the very front of the brain and this is actually still developing up until the end of your teenage years. Now because the prefrontal cortex is the part of the brain responsible for your cognition, your attention, your processing of information, the fact that it's still progressing and still growing in this time period means that it's actually very vulnerable to the effects of nicotine which can actually prevent the development of that specific part of the brain. Now what this means is for people that smoke in their teenage years they can have long-term problems with attention so attention deficits, struggling to focus as a result of having smoked when their brain was still developing. Also they are more at risk of psychiatric disorders in adulthood if they smoked during their teenage years and they might also have problems with their cognitive processing so understanding things and processing information. 